Hi, I'm Austin. And I'm Dan. And we're here to play games. Badly. Yes. Yes. Welcome back to Persona 3 Reload, where we began our climb through Tartarus yet again. <laughs> we made it all the way to floor 184. And we are going to continue that trek today. As we get further up, we're heading towards 192. 198. 198. I don't know why the two is always there in my head. 198. So we're roughly um, halfway up there from our starting point. 184 down. One million to go. <laughs> yes. We're going to be here a while. Yep. There are definitely over 200 floors. I think the max is in the 260s. So. Yep. We're, we're still going to be here a hot minute. Yep, we're a good ways up though. So we are, and we're we're in Funky Town now, given yeah. how the uh, the new block looks. I love Haraba so far. <laughs> it's it's a regular uh, party. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Who, do, who do we have in our party at the moment? Uh, oh, oh yeah, we were gonna explore the uh, party composition. I forgot about that. Um, but if this is your first time here, welcome. If you've never seen our videos, uh, we are very silly. We like to have a good time, and we like to talk about a lot of different things. We were breaking down some of the the uh, Arcana and their correlation to our party members last time, and we'll continue that discussion here shortly. Uh, but if you do want to see the entire game from Episode 1, check the top right-hand corner. We'll have a playlist card there for you. So, yeah. Otherwise, welcome, welcome. All right. Yes, indeed. We needed something, I thought, for the last... Something indeed. Yeah. So the we're about to fight the Tartarus Guardian. There are two, at least. Um, one of oh man, stuff started scrolling. Uh, one of them, Nulls. Bothering him? Do you smell anything in that area? Koromaru Chan. Hmm. Uh, one of them, Nulls, slash and strike, and ice, and resists lightning, and has no weakness. The other one, drains lightning, repels light and is weak to fire. Oh, well, then we're in a good shape then, for the most part. Yes, the only problem is Ken is not going to be very useful. Yeah, that's true. Offensively, but he's a decent healer, so if you want to hold on to him and just have Koromaru and Junpei. We can bring... Handle it. We can bring Takuma back. She's always a good... Whoop, wrong button. Fine by me. Ken's higher level now anyway, so... Yeah, that's true. Yeah, we'll do that. Junpei is fire, so he'll do well in this one. Yep. Alright. Is, is he charged up? I can't recall. I don't recall. E yes. Yeah, he and Kormar are both maxed out. <laughs> Good. And, I like it. Um, Takaba and Makoto are very close. Yeah. We could probably go ahead and... Um, Koromaru's Theurgy, one of his applies Charge Concentrate, is that right? Uh, I th think it's, uh, the Charge, yeah, I think it's Charge. Okay. It might be Charge and Concentrate, yeah, we'll find out here in a second. Let's go! Let's go! Hell yeah! Looks tougher than I thought, but ain't nothing stopping me, dude. What's up, dude? All right. It is. This is a little yeah, tackle, more than double with damage for all eyes. Yep. So that isn't going to help with Blaze of Life, but it is good. Depends. Um, good so yesterday. the Merciless it's Judge is the one without a weakness, and if you're going to use Fizz on it, use Pierce only. Mm. But nothing is resistant against. Uh, oh, Maragadine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could do Maragadine. That would work very well. Are you going to say nothing's resistant against Almighty? No, it, neither of them are resistant against like dark. That's true. You said light and lightning. I think specifically were the big ones. Light, lightning, ice, and a couple of the fizz. Don't use slash or strike. What to do? Correct. On the big guy. You can use Pierce though. Yeah. 
<laughs> as always, <laughs> keeping it going with Maragadine as well, if you want to keep the weakness hits going. Yeah. Um, I think what I actually want to do is this. It's going to refresh it. Right? Oh, that's, no. yeah, I forgot I did Sylphid Why'd that say attack up? Did they? Interesting. I don't know. I thought we used Sylphid Aura, right? We did. Yes. Huh? What next? Maybe I missed and they use like, Dikaja or something. Isis! Yeah, I don't know. Isis! No, that was close. You dodged it! All right. That really didn't hit as hard as I thought it would. <laughs> well, it raised the defense, too. Alright. Single foe. Trismagistus. Such a cool... This theurgy is so much better than his other one. I really like it. Oh, it's so sweet. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, well, let's just go ahead and get this out of our system, shall we? Yup. Um, okay. Oh, he's got all kinds of pierce. That'll be good. That's true. And he's Isha Mountain. Isha Isha well. Mountain. We'll do this. We'll do this. Hey, good we go. idea. What you got for me? Juno. Juno slash Hera. <laughs> I'll take it. Yeah, all the buffs going. Sure do. I don't understand. It doesn't... Oh, never mind. Oh, were you looking at the enemy stats thinking it was ours? Hmm? Were you looking at the enemy stat thinking it was ours? Oh, uh, no. Next magic attack will do... Yeah. That's Together, fine. We can't lose. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Oh, you dodged it. That's What's our the leader. Alright. Warpal Blade is normally really good. Man, it's uh yeah, best friends is for one ally. Ooh, would concentrate affect this? Should. Let's try this. <laughs> Been a while. Yeah. Oh. Not bad. That was awesome. <laughs> 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 oh, perfect. That's so much easy. damage. Look at all those levels. Got a good chunk of EXP there. Sure oh, did. Yeah. Agadine. Get out of here, Agilal. Love how it still has Maragi, though. It's... Yeah, they, that never upgrades. I know, it's so dumb, though. <laughs> yep. I wish it would. That would be nice. Harder research. Oh, we were just talking about this last time, too. Right, so this allows for that somewhat random okay. chase game to be beaten without needing to randomly guess. That's good. Yeah. Great, now we can keep moving. Even though the theory about defeating the shadows that appeared during a full moon was just a trick, I'm sure there's something here that can help us get rid of the dark hour. Only one way to find out. <laughs> I'm glad you're so motivated, Yuki-kun. It's definitely best to get as far as we can rather than sitting around mulling over hypotheticals. It's incredible how you always find a silver lining, Yukari-chan. Honestly, half of it probably just me putting up a front, but the other half is thanks to you, Fuka. Thank you for giving me that recording. Yukari-chan. Alright, time to get going. Lead the way, Yukikun. Yukikun! Yeah! Yukikun! the strong ones that block our path, but just how many are there? A lot. A million. God, I'm just basking in the colors everywhere. <laughs> yeah. So cool. Uh, let's give it to Koromaru and then see what it does. That's the best idea. 
<laughs> the bear paws. No light insta kill. Nice. Mm. That's good because Koromaru is weak to light, right? Yeah. Uh, so versus a knife polished so thoroughly that it shines for Koromaru. Oh, there's another. Precious, precious egg. egg. Can I offer you a precious egg in this trying time? <laughs> it makes you think of the movie Cool Runnings. Where he's like, you mm. want to kiss my lucky egg? Yes. Oh, dear. And the other guy's like, I will kiss no egg. <laughs> Give you a layout of the whole floor. You can even... Oh, boy. Reveals the full map of the floor you're currently on as it reveals the stairs. It will unlock the option to shortcut to them. Does take stamina though, so you can use it over and over. But use it when you need to. Yeah, I'd sit on that until the next time we find a greedy shadow, at least for now. Yep. All right. All right. All right. Magic incense. Magic. Cool, cool, cool. So, I'm uh. Sure, we're gonna use this incense at some point, oh, by the way. That enemy is rare. There will be an instance where it's going to be quite useful. It's luxury! Is the luxury hand the one that resists everything? I think it does, yeah. Oh, it scrolled all the way up to the top. Oh, man. All right, I need to do something that will lower yeah, it. Nulls all elements resist physical. Good luck. There we go. Hmm. Nope. That's what I want right there. What have you done? Yeah, it's a good idea. Now's the time. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, she, she has, has it too. too. Yep. You could win break and then use Gardine. Yeah, that's, that's true. Too. Let's see. It's just the the turn order. That's not what I'm trying to say. The turn economy is bad on doing Windbreak and then Gyarodyne. Yeah. That's one of the reasons I don't to tend do. to use it very much, so... We could always toss it in Yukari's build if, if you want to. Severe, heavy, great blade. There we go. All enemies defeated. All right. Good work out there. Thank you. It's worth it when you can get them. That coin is so scintillating. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what are you? That Jotun of blood! Wait, what the hell? Oh, this is... okay. There's like two of these. Oh. Uh, no, no light, weak to dark. Alright. Works for me. Ooh, that's um, you got a lot of health. Got a lot, a lot of health, yeah. Beefy. <laughs> He's a Chungus. You all can right. tell when Ken is not in the party because they don't like giggle every time you do an all out. I <laughs> hear just randomly go struggling. <laughs> 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 uh, that is good. That is some good stuff. <laughs> yeah. All right, um, so let's continue our wind conversation, amp. shall we? Oh, yes, this will work. Okay, well, you're gonna get wind amp on that. Yeah, yeah, sure. We can go back to. Uh, so we'll talk about the lovers. Um, the lovers are Kana. That's uh, Yukari Takeba, her persona, our lovers, and her social link is lovers as well. So she's one of the few that kind of. Lines up, if you're familiar with Persona 5, Persona 4, their way of doing it. She lines up similar to that. Nice. nice. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so the Lover's Arcana. Ooh, let's, let's pick stuff. Ooh, single target boost is good. Got three of those right. already. Okay. Could level up Ronda. You could. That. So the Lover's Arcana signifies perfect union, harmony, love, and attraction. It can represent 
finding the balance within oneself and one's values, as well as the ability to make the right decision, even if it's difficult. I'll leave that one up to you on Evade Ice, by the way. I'm not sure... Evade Ice might be nice. Pass along. If I were to pick something to drop, it'd be my Aga, but that's that's still an okay skill. Um, I've got plenty of other personas that have it. Or Matarunda, either one. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Alright, now, back to business. So, um, making tough calls and uh, signifies union, harmony, love, and attraction. The lovers, um, Arcana. So, Yukari's first persona is Eo. Ooh, Monad. Nice. So, Eo. Uh, was a priestess in the service of the goddess Hera. Uh, when Zeus fell in love with her, he transformed her into a cow to hide her from Hera, but Hera saw through the ruse. She was rescued by Hermes and escaped across the sea to safety. Oh, I just made that connection of cow, like why Eo has like the bull mm -hmm. face. Hello. Yep. I don't think I ever caught that before. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um, and you have a note here regarding being rescued by Her Hermes and how that's evidence of the significance of Yukari and Junpei's friendship. Uh, yeah, well, I just, I wonder if that is why that's there, right? Because they had a pre-existing friendship before we showed up. Um, that's true. They, they like, like knew each other and right. stuff. Yeah. So I, I don't know how that directly ties into their knowing of each other and, and then their relationship. But there is interesting that, that Hermes and Eo have that friendship because of what happened mythologically speaking yeah so yeah another fun thing about eo is it's one of the moons of jupiter mm. Let's get it's kind of cool yeah void giant I'm still setting up it'll take a little more time the heck where is this Hold it's on. A monad door that helps i mean i mean yeah yeah i just uh we're in haraba right yes Oh, fascinating. All right, so... I just don't... Not weak to dark. <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. Good grief. I don't know why that took so long for me to find. So... It nulls slash... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> reflects wind. <laughs> resist strike... Weak to fire. Okay. Repels ice and wind. Nulls light and dark. All right. What to do? It didn't null the dark. Well. <laughs> Let's see if it's weak to fire. All right. Good deal. Ah. My source is not 100% reliable. There might be a variant where that does... Operate differently. I guess. I can die. So yeah, that was that was my only rule note. There is just that pre-existing relationship, and maybe there's some significance on why they're friends. Yep. Or the connection thereof. Could be. Yeah. It's a pretty loose connection, but I don't. I I kind of like it. Yeah. Um. Now Isis. Uh, Yukari's second persona, Isis, uh, is Osiris's wife, as well as his younger sister. Upon the death of her husband at the hands of Seth, she traveled all over Egypt to recover the pieces of his body, and revived him with her incredible magic power. So, Isis is the Egyptian equivalent of, of Eo, mythologically speaking. So, I found that to be kind of cool. Now we gotta make a hard choice here. Ooh. Ooh. Trying to think of passing skills along. Cause Slash Amp, we, we definitely wanna keep it. It's 
all. That's one. Heat wave isn't amped by it, so you could drop that and just have him be a slash specialist. Uh, Heat wave is good, but I think you've got other persona with it on. I think I do too. Yeah. So that would specialize him. You're a little less versatile, but I think I think it works. A oh, lot, especially for passing stuff on. I think that's gonna be the better option. Oh, hello. Yep. Because we want to keep all those really good passives. Yeah, that's that's a tough choice. <laughs> mm-hmm. Um, so Osiris, yeah. uh, right? That's what you said. Uh, Isis, Isis is Osiris's wife. Yeah. What do we yes. What do we know about Osiris? I don't recall. Osiris. I'm just curious about what the relationship is there. Mm, Osiris as well, uh, wife as well as his younger sister is Osiris. I don't think so. As as it relates to like these persona and stuff like how that would correlate. Uh, hold on. If I'm following your question, I don't think it relates to another persona. Let me see. No, I don't. I don't think it relates to persona specifically. Um, there's no oh. Osiris persona this time. Uh, but... How can I rephrase my question? Osiris was an ancient Egyptian god who represented the afterlife, fertility, resurrection, and the cycle of the Nile River. Uh, basically the god of the dead in resurrection. Interesting. Okay. Mm-hmm. The Lord of Silence! <laughs> okay, we'll just... Just this wins again. Hmm. Okay. And is mythologically Later. how Isis. Um, well, that's mythologically who Osiris is. Right, right. And how and so, so I just wasn't mm -hmm. sure if say uh since Isis was married to Osiris, if if that relationship with Osiris being the god of death, right? Sure. If that correlated to something else in game, for instance, but it doesn't seem not, to. So not that I'm aware of. No. <laughs> yeah. I think it's just part of the lore of ISIS. Right. I was just curious. My curiosity. Okay, yeah. coffee. We have a lot of precious eggs. Oh, here we go. Good. All right. Let's see here. Got me curious now. Uh -huh. Make you ask questions. Oh, he's running away. Get him. <laughs> Get him anyway. All right, we Looks have like fire will work great. Fire on these guys. Don't know what that one. Electric. Probably wind. Pull the trigger. Time to shine. Ice it. <laughs> Wind. Got it. What's the name of this show? <laughs> What's the name of the shadow? Yeah. I don't know. I can tell you next time I run into it. So, Ooh, there are Suzuki. some Ooh. parallels to Orpheus with Osiris. They have some similarities. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Uh, carry a, a crook staff. Uh, there's some similarities. They're from different mythological traditions, I believe. Because uh, Orpheus is Greek, I believe. Right. And then Osiris is Egyptian. Of course. Um, but yeah, that's a similarity. Interesting. Um, pretty loose one, but close enough. Oh. <laughs> Perfecto. Ooh, forgot to open the chest. Perfecto. A fierce sutra. 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 You can do Butter. It, okay, so. You have What's the next one we are going to cover? Person. Wait, what? Hold on, what's she talking about? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I forget. It went away. All I, right, I hate fine. that the conversation goes away the moment I, like, do anything different. 
Yeah, that's Wait. that's yeah. Where are you going? Ah. He's trying to run away. <laughs> He's afraid. Right. Fire what are careful. these? They're they're gracious Whoa. cupids. Okay, so yeah, don't use fire. Use strike if you can. Right. Um, the chariot. Uh, I guess. So the chariot represents overcoming obstacles through determination, focus, and willpower. It indicates needing to put any worries aside and remain focused through obstacles, keeping your composure to overcome. Wow, that's not I guess I don't know what it is. Uh, yep, it's pretty perfect. Uh, and then I really like I guess is Persona Palladion. Mm -hmm. uh, Palladion is a guardian statue in ancient Greece, stolen from Troy, that protected the city in which it was enshrined. It is said that Athena was so saddened by the death of her friend Pallas that she had the wooden statue made in her image. That's crazy. Yeah, and this was your observation, Austin, that. Uh, Palladian isn't a true mythical living person, and I guess isn't a quote unquote real girl, <laughs> right? Like, because right, she's, she's a robot. A construction, yeah. A construct, a weapon, if you will. Yeah. I, I, I just thought that was really poignant um, mm -hmm. use of that persona for her specifically. Yep. Um, yeah, I think you've got the info for this. Uh, they also drain Elec and Null Light, by the way. Okay. Ruinous Idol. Uh, I also wonder if Palladian is kind of where we get the, um, weak to dark. Okay, he's going to absorb that. That's fine. If I can just knock it out. You just her. Yeah. Um, I wonder if that's where we get, like, our root for Aladdin. Possibly. I could see it. In this situation, time to shine. Because she's much, she's a lot like a Paladin as well. In some respects. How so? So, um, outside of like, okay. Stalwart? Sure. Right? Have we? We've gotten Belfort before, okay. Let's say maybe He's on the toilet. He is. Belfort is um, weird. Yeah. Anyway, go ahead. So. <laughs> Separating the religious aspects of paladins, right? Because they're often seen as like the holy marine, um, with their lay on hands and the ability to smite evil and all of that. Um, there's a lot of like religious undertones to paladins, but mm -hmm. if we're talking about what else they represent, which is this stalwart warrior who has sworn an oath that they will. Always follow a a, a pretty well. um a set of standards that they set for themselves that they must follow at all times. Um, which you know you might just say it's night at that point, but like there there's something specific about paladins that are like this. Um, so like a, a, a creed might be that they will always uh, step in to defend those in need, right? Okay. Um, and, you know, in the religious side of it, it could be like, you know, if they, to put it in like a Pathfinder setting, maybe they worship the god Ayamade, who is uh, like the goddess of uh, justice, swift justice. <laughs> um, so, like, she does not tolerate evil actions. She, she requires that all uh, anything that is evil be struck down um, without quarter, essentially. Mm -hmm. um, you know, so they have, like, these creeds that they uh, swear their oaths to. So it's a little more than just, like, the chivalry of the, the knight, let's say. Who's who has strong martial prowess? Um, it's a nuanced thing, but sure. in a lot of ways, I feel I feel like Igis has some of that energy of being a paladin. She is she is there to serve Makoto as much as she said at least that she is serving him specifically. She watches out for mm -hmm. him, mm -hmm. and she watches out for all of them. But like 
in a lot of ways, he represents her oath that she's taken. Sure. Or has been programmed with, I guess. I'm still setting up. Um, It'll take a little more time. Okay. I could see it. It it seems a little closer to just like a nightly oath to me a little bit. Sure. But, yeah. Like eh. I, like I said, because you're taking the religious aspect out of it, which is part of what makes paladins what they are. But. Um, um, the description of Palladian is interesting. If you've played Megaton games, especially modern ones, you know that there is a demon called Palace Athena, um, which Palladion is the statue made uh, of Pallas by Athena. Hmm. So it's interesting. It's an interesting name. You know what? Actually, let's do this. Yeah. Do it. Oh, um, we play with that slash increase? Yeah. That was 25. It's, it's over. Good job, everyone. Some good damage. <laughs> I read that right, right? That was 2,536 yes. or something like that? Yes. Okay. Yes, that's correct. It was about 2,500 damage. Oh, my gosh. Yep. <laughs> This is how you do crazy damage um, in these sorts of games. You, you just stack the boosts. They multiply a lot of times. Oh my, that was so much. It's also why um, job, physical, because phys attacks can crit and they can be charged. Um, that's why often fizz attacks in the past have not gotten any amps or boosts. Mm. Um, just use them. Or as elements get, like magic kits, boosts, and amps. Gotcha. Wow, we're already on the to our guardian. guardian. That was fast. No, not that. Yes, it was. Okay, so 188. <laughs> she just said, hey, don't forget about your consumables. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Fuka. I appreciate it. All right, one of these bosses nulls fire and wind and repels light. And then the other one is weak to slash damage. So, hey, 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 bring secret. And uh, resists electric and nulls dark. Seems like you could just level the physical hammer on this next boss and just take it out. That mm. seems like the best strategy okay. to me. Because... Uh, one of them does not resist f any fizz, and then the other one is weak to slash. So just pour slash attacks on them. Oh, but I have my nice slash. Does that Kahiko have slash? He's strike. His I guess has some slash, right? She's pierce slash? She's pierce predominantly. And she doesn't have any no. slashing abilities. Pure strike, that's what she is, yeah. And he's only got strike. Correct. Okay. Alright, so... Leave Junpei. Uh, Mitsuru does have slash yep. attacks. Could bring her. Yeah. Alright, we'll do that. That'll work. Oop. Yuppers. Level 64! Congrats! We're now playing Whoa. Persona 64. That's right. It just suddenly turns to N64 graphics. <laughs> That'd be weird. It's all blocky. <laughs> Doo -doo -pa -pa -doo -pow. How are you? This is actually Mario 64. Yep. Yes. We this fooled is... you into thinking we were playing Persona. This is actually Mario. I mean, this is kind of what one of the Bowser area looks like. Do, 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 do. It's the endless staircase. Oh, my. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got a backwards long jump up or you'll never get there, man. Yep, because that works. Yep, the totally works. enemy is strong. Make sure you're ready to before fighting. Let's go. Yes, I will be ready to before fighting. Exactly. Uh-huh. I'm not going to move them. We'll make you. Ah, blah, blah, get blah, blah. Charga. Okay. Tank is charging! Charging tank! <sighs> I'll go with. Oh, wait. Yeah, hold on. Do. Come here, Siegfried. Where are you? What are you doing? 
There you go. Uh, all foes, yeah. All foes. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> oh is he Do that again? Is he weak to anything? What's I don't that? think so. No. Right? Okay. No. Weak to nothing. All right. Well, those guys are gone. Now's the time. And none of that matters. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. Do not use fire, wind, or light on the Chaos Panzer. You could concentrate in Bufu dying, though. That'd yeah. be cool. Alright, what we got here? Heavy pierce to one foe. Yeah. Ow. Oof. That hurt. I'll go with. Ow. Uh, I haven't used a Brave Blade yet. Yeah, might as well charge it. It's not gonna have some health. Alright. Who needs health? Um, this guy does. <laughs> you know, the one who, if he dies, we have to start this entire thing over. <laughs> yes. If he dies, we must start the, the whole plan? game over. It will delete our save. A whole... No, this is not Witch's House, alright? <laughs> Whoa, and it frozen. Persona 3 Reload. Hardcore mode. Uh... Why not? Right. Oh, that's a critical hit. Because it's frozen. Yep. Attack! That was a vile combination of concentrate, Bufudine, and freeze with a critical hit. Uh huh. Oh, there's. There's just levels. Starting to feel the power. Ma! <laughs> the power. Damn Rita shower, heck yeah. yeah. Right over I'm Rita drop. Get out of here. What's next? My guy dying. cool. Uh, Looks like we're about to reach the 200th floor. Just how tall is this place? Yes. <laughs> At the very least, there should be an end as for when we'll Ooh, get there. No. We'll just have to keep climbing and find out. What's wrong, Yukari? Are you tired? Uh, does it look like I'm dying? Well, if I'm just rare to go, be it 300 or 400 floors. 7,000 floors. <laughs> 300 floors? No thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I know how you feel, but Yukari might be good on your case, you know? Jeez, Mitsuru Senpai, you're making me out to be a total witch, but I think I'd be nicer than you. Oh, oh damn. Well then, wanna keep going, yuki -kun? Maybe we'll go discover something. Yukari's right. Let's keep advancing, even if only a step at a time. 97 more years, 9 more Are you floors. Are you watching your health and stamina? Remember Cars. not to push yourself okay. too hard. I mean, once you've reached 200 floors, which is another 60, right? Whatever. Yeah. These floors do go a lot faster than you would think that they do. Yeah. Well, it speeds up the more powerful you get. Kind of... Cersei's bow. Oh, cool. Hey. Equip it! Let's go. Alright, what you got? Cool looking. 260 magic plus five. Oh, that's actually pretty good. You're not bad. Favored by an ancient witch. Funny how we were just talking about that. Mm hmm. Looks like a long bow. Yeah, it does. Or a composite bow or something. Yeah. All right, cool. So, these, these strength arcana. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, okay. Yes, there are, well. yes, Let's strong enemies. The, the Strength Arcana, Koromaru. Strength represents mastering raw emotions in order to bring calm you to yourself. From Polonia Mall in the shopping district. Uh, a in order to bring... What uh oh do? Oh no, a treasure chest! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> represents overcoming snakes. challenges. In order to bring calm to yourself or a situation. Represents overcoming challenges like the chariot, but usually refers to inner challenges, such as our own doubts, fears, and anxieties, and finding courage. Uh, can be seen as taming the wild ways within or helping to tame others. 
the fun little arcana for Koromaru, who's best boy. Yeah. Talking about taming wild. Mm-hmm. All right. That snake is very we'll immoral. It else. is. <laughs> I don't like it. Mm-hmm. Ah. Ah. Okay, immoral snake is weak to... Oh. Weak to slash and pierce. Oh, really? Don't use wind on it. Yeah. Really, really. Oh. Slash and pierce, huh? Yes. Oh. Goodbye. Oh. Good work out there. <laughs> Austin is embracing the power of fizz damage. I, it's just so much. Uh huh. Ooh, Kugayan, nice. Yeah. Level up, Siegfried. Thank you. Did we get his? Oh yeah, we got his uh, persona item, right? Absolutely. Let's not. Um. Cerberus. Right. Uh, Koromaru's persona. The giant hound that guards the great abyss, Tartarus. He answers to Hades, the lord of the underworld, and keeps watch for both intruders and escapees. He was born from Typhon and Echidna, and is the older brother of Orthrus. Um, he typically is portrayed as having three heads, a serpent for a tail, and snakes protruding from his body. And of course, Cerberus is commonly seen in Final Fantasy as well, with three heads, so. Right. Uh, what is the battle wheel? Battle wheel! It's weak to battle. It's not weak to anything, it nulls light. Really? Yes. Alright. All right, we'll do that then. Um, do it. Yeah, all these uh, persona Cerberus and Isis no um, having a relationship with their their equivalent god of death, mm -hmm. I find very fascinating because of a discussion we had before the start of this recording, and I don't want to go into right now because we mm -hmm. haven't had that revealed to us yet. Mm -hmm. um, but it's really interesting. It's a little bit of a theme, isn't it? It, it is. Mm -hmm. We have him in our party, so cool. Chernabog! Uh, it's Evil Toad! Uh, yeah. Well, every time I see Chernabog, I think of Chernobyl, and I don't think that's on purpose, but... Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> weak slash what? one to four... Poison mist. Yeah. Yeah, soul sea drop. Got lots of those. Success. All right. Let's be on our way. Salut. Salut. This floor has. All right. Uh, yep. Yeah, that's everything. Okay. I think for the next one, I am going to skip ahead here to the Justice Arcana. Because um, okay. I do want to make sure to cover everyone in the party pretty quickly here. Um, so Justice uh, is well, Kanemata. In... I bet the Ooh. journey would be just as fun as the destination. Yeah, totally. We'd stuff our faces with snacks and play card games. It'd be Come a here. blast. Sounds like a blast. Sounds like a blast. I won't miss my chance. We've got the advantage. Don't hold anything So, the Justice Arcana represents justice. What? I know, it's shocking, isn't it? Um, but it usually represents karmic or legal justice, but more generally, uh, cause and effect. Um, explains that all actions have consequences and begs the question of how your actions contributed to current circumstances. Sometimes represented by scales to represent the balance of justice. So, it's a pretty straightforward one to compare to some of them, like death or tower. Um, you know, what is the balance of karma? What is the balance of, you know, 
what have you done and how what effects have come from that. Uh, it's like a self-reflecting sort of thing. Mm -hmm. Which is interesting. Um, so, Kenemata's first persona, Nemesis, uh, is a Greek goddess who is the personification of the god's wrath or divine retribution. While known to administer vengeance, she was also perceived as fair and balanced, punishing only those that deserved it. Oh, really personifying justice there a little bit. Agarudine! Love that. Yeah, me too. Right. Let's be on our way. Uh, and then the second evolution of Ken's persona, Kalanimi, is a Hindu goddess whose name means edge of the wheel of time the wheel refers to samsara which is a cycle of death and rebirth within kind of hindu mythology theology um, so what that means is kalanimi is the goddess who has transcended life itself all right then moving on um other interesting thing about kalanimi is uh she is an ashura in hindu mythology which may be regarded as an anti-god as opposed to the benevolent devas or, sh or or shuras, who are heavenly beings or gods. Um, so not exactly a demon, as one might know in Western religion, but certainly kind of an anti-existence to the more benevolent gods. Ah, oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Asheras are a fun concept, and if we keep playing Megaton, Megaton games, we're going to be coming back to that, um, with some of the games in particular. Hey, buddy. Um, I think you had an observation about Kalanimi as well here. Oh, uh, yeah, because, um, well, specifically the relationship between Nemesis and then Kalanimi, right? Um, yeah. Because Ken is seeking justice. Right. For his mom. Um, mm -hmm. Justified, if not uh, a little misguided. Yeah, and the way he's approaching it. Um, Agree. Um, but your observation was internal balance rather than external. Transcending life here would be an indication of his growth beyond his need for vengeance. Yes. Right. Yeah. It's right. Because because Kalanimi is about is about that balance and you, like and sure. the enlightenment, right? The transcendence of mm -hmm. that. So it makes me. Like, obviously, it's not so grandiose as he actually transcends physical life. Maybe his understanding of what's important. I'm feeling good about this. Balancing himself internally to that versus his need for... His need to inflict violence upon the person who ultimately led to his mob's death. Mm -hmm. Which we see yep. that. We see that growth. Like, in the mm -hmm. moment. Uh, Very much so. Yeah. The second evolutions all seem to be very significant in this game, which I quite appreciate. Yeah, me too. I, I think it's important that these second evolutions, yeah. especially when you operate under the knowledge that these are manifestations of their persona. Right? Yeah. Their they're inner self, yeah. Actualized inner self. Um, and so with that manifestation, I feel like it's important to have it correlate to the character. All right. I don't think I've ever dissected it to this degree before, but I've, it's been really I kind of eye-opening, and I've been appreciating it. Yep. This is something that uh, I wonder, because I haven't really analyzed this with 4 or 5 before, how much of that, other than there's a couple of blindingly obvious things with a few of them. <laughs> And just thematically speaking. Right, yeah, but, of course. Yep. <laughs> you know, like all the, all of, well, most of the first personas of in Persona 5 are fitting the gentleman thief archetype, right. which is interesting. Back in a monad door here. Whoops. What do we got? Maybe I can actually find the frickin' thing this time. Mm. But that's a world balance. Looks like it. Which makes me assume that it's going to resist everything. Not according to this. It's uh, 
It's not weak to anything, but it doesn't resist anything. World balance. So use whatever you want. Man. Siegfried. Oh, I guess that was useless. Whatever. Useless! He's not resistant, you dum dum. Wah! <laughs> Alright, focus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Where are you aiming? Oh, that's awesome. Braid Blade is near the top of power as far as slash attacks go. Mm -hmm. It's incredibly strong. It's probably the strongest when it comes to raw power for a single hit uh, slash. Well yeah, charged blade, brave blade is just, just kind of gross. <laughs> yeah, it's very, very strong. Ooh, Sayodani. Heck yeah. All right. Oh, hello. Easy enough. You did it. I did it. Hmm. We are fastly approaching the level to take on the Reaper. Mm-hmm. What level is that? I don't know. Hmm. 72? I guess? I don't know. Mm hmm Yeah, that'll be something we'll we'll want to do uh, as soon as we can, I think. Yeah, well, especially if we're going to grind out it to 91. We got to do it. Yep. Yep. Be careful. I'll go with There we go. Alright, so that was Justice. Are we missing any? I know this yes. one's there. On, there are a couple of others we haven't um, covered yet. Um, also, it is interesting. We were just talking about the wheel, uh, referring to Samsara with Kalanimi, and that is, I believe, the name of the instant kill move on Daisojo. Hmm. So. Use the wheel of time literally to one shot people. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Um, so, I did do some checking, and we're going to cover the Hermit and the Wheel of Fortune Arcana. Um, so, the Hermit, uh, Jin Shirato, has the uh, persona with the Hermit Arcana. Um, I don't know that we ever actually see that because we don't see the stat screens right. um, for anyone in uh, Strega. But um, Jin uh, is kind of representing the Hermit. Uh, the Hermit represents a period of soul searching, self reflection, and spiritual enlightenment. Strongly indicates contemplation. Oh, pretty well and discovering your true spiritual self through meeting one's own needs. Mm. So, sort of a contemplative. Uh, it's indicating the need to be contemplative and kind of reflective and all of that. Right. Seek enlightenment. <laughs> um, now, the hermit, uh, or rather, Jin's persona oh, is called Moros. Uh, Moros is the personification and god of doom in Greek mythology. It manifests as a shapeless spirit that bears the responsibility of revealing the day of one's impending demise. Uh, because of this, he also came to be known as a spirit of depression for the souls whose death he revealed are ridden with sadness and anguish. Um, and Austin, your observation here on the responsibility of revealing the day of one's impending demise is he's regularly reminding Takaya of the bigger picture. Right, yeah. Um, yeah, because Takaya keeps wanting to, like, engage 
in the fight with the hero, right? The party. And this is, we've seen it happen at least two, maybe three times where Jin's, Jin's was like, hey, don't do this. You have more pressing matters. Right. Like, don't worry about them. What we're doing right now is going to take care of them on its own, uh -huh. essentially. Exactly, yeah. Um, so just just that that uh, attention to detail. Uh, contemplativeness? I don't know. Whatever. I don't Contemplativeness. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, we talked... contemplation. Right. Mm -hmm. We talked about this before. Um, mm. Where we discussed um, whether or not Takaya thinks he's the prince for, right. for death. And I've been mulling it over and I don't think that's the case. Um, that okay. Excellent and my, my reasoning being good work. is that he didn't want the shadows defeated to begin with. True. Um, and so I don't think he knew about that specifically. I think he has an alternative goal knew about what the prince thing yeah oh well, yeah i don't think he knew about the okay. prince thing or that that defeating the shadows would create Focus. death or the the would create the uh would the the sign of death approaching or something i don't however that sure. works mm -hmm. um Looks like fire, will work fire and pierce okay i can see that so i think he has a different goal like sure. just completely different goal. Mm -hmm. uh, and what could that goal be? Well, that I don't know, because um, mm -hmm. it's not really clear yet. That's true. So, just to, still figuring it out. Yeah, just food for thought, because I, I I just realized that I don't think we're quite right in his goals as far as being the prince. I do think he thinks he's chosen. Um, mm -hmm. But not necessarily for the, not as the the harkener of death or whatever, harbinger, whatever. Um, the harbinger of death. Right. He's not. He's not the you know the prophet preceding its arrival or whatever. Sure. <clears throat> so, speaking of uh, the wheel of fortune. Arcana, sometimes just called Fortune, um, is Takaya's persona. Um, so Fortune represents luck or destiny and signifies change coming for the greater good. The Though it may be in an upward or downward manner as represented by the wheel. Mm. Also represents the cycle of changes in life, even if it's uncomfortable at times. Be nice to people on your way up. You may be meeting them again on your way back down. Mm -hmm. So that's that speaks a little to the chosen nature that you're talking about right. with regards to that. Yeah. Um, I like the idea of fortune as a wheel. You could be ascending one side only to descend the other side later. Mm -hmm. Speaks to how fickle fortune is. Yeah. And then Takaya's persona is uh, Hypnos. Uh, Hypnos is the god and personification of sleep in Greek mythology. Uh, it's said to be a calm and gentle deity that helps humans in need and owns half their lives. Which makes a lot of sense. You sleep for half your life, roughly. Right. <laughs> not, not really, but roughly. Um... So yeah, I thought that one was cool. Um, Takaya is interesting. We we still got to learn some stuff about Takaya, but I get those levels. Um, that's that's all of the Arcana I have to cover for right now. Um, there are more. We haven't covered every single one. Um, in particular. We have not covered, as far as people wielding Persona, we haven't covered Temperance, uh, the Devil, the Tower, the Star, the Moon, the Sun, Judgment, the World, or Aeon. And uh, incidentally, the World is 
kind of the one that represents the completion of the fool's journey and aeon is from another it's from a different deck basically um so if you play persona 5 it's a little like faith or counselor mm. uh, and then four was aeon in four as well i don't remember aeon being in four hold on but it might have been Yeah, yeah, Aeon was in four. Um, yeah, uh, Aeon was Marie's in, in Persona 4. Oh, okay, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I forgot about Marie. Yep, so, yeah, and then Aeon is also in this game as well. Uh, we, I believe we have some Aeon Personas. We do. Floating around, so... But yeah, all of those aren't uh, other than the wild card, uh, other than the main character here, our hero. Uh, we don't have anybody that wields exclusively those other arcana that we know of yet. All right. But there is some more that we will be coming back to, particularly on a few of the more important ones. Uh, the Fool, um, uh, the Chariot, um, Death, and Judgment. I'll have some interesting other developments, so we'll be circling back to that with part three of our lecture on Arcana. <laughs> when we get there. Yeah. Alright. Leader! But yeah, as as promised, we did some digging so that you could have some lore. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's it's interesting. Um, I do think there's a fair amount of pattern recognition that can happen where maybe it wasn't intended to make certain connections, but we we just kind of are making that. Does it make sense? Sure, yeah. But you know, that's fun. That's fun too. Why not? Right. Right. Even if it's unintentional, there is still some something interesting about it. Mm, yeah. Azuzu. Yeah, there are a few Arcana in here that do not have a lot of Persona, so oh. Aeon has four. <laughs> Just by the way. I don't know if it has the least. Well, it does have the least, but I don't know if any other Help one even button. comes close to that. Be careful. I think there might be one other one that's got like maybe five or six. Judgment has six. Yeah. Yeah. But that's, you know, as opposed to Fool, which has like nine or something. Right. Magician has like ten, I think. So. We're almost at the 200th floor. There's another gatekeeper first, though. We should be getting close to. Oh. Yes, I'm sensing a border floor. It's five floors up from here. Just a little further to go. Let's get through here first. I sent someone on a higher floor. It's a floor we haven't been to yet, though. Oh, yeah, that's right. We still have to rescue somebody else. 193. Okay. Yep. Anybody I should rescue, be aware of? The next rescue is on 196. Hmm. Soul spinach. Someone. Oh, oh I did not mean to do that. Dang it. All right. Well, it's fine. I'll hold on to the I guess rest. They're all healed. <laughs> yeah, I was. I thought I grabbed the um, probiotic pack and I wasn't paying attention. So that's my bad. All right. Well, that's all right. Um, oh, whoops. What have I done here? Oh no, this is good. I'm gonna be shoot myself in the foot with it, but whatever. Uh, when did you last save? Just now. 
And before Good that, God. it was... Uh, you mean you saved after doing that? Okay, yeah. fine. That's all right. Well, um, before that, it would have been like several floors. Several, several floors. Yeah, that's fine. Just move on. Yep. Let's see here. Ooh, I wonder when we can get that one. All the theurgy okay, is maxed out, too. Gonna be a minute on the next theurgy for the main character. Yep. Uh, Scarlet Havoc is pretty solid. Let's see. Should I switch Jumpy out for anybody, you think? Um... You could. You want to get some levels for somebody else. Akihiko or Igus. Would be good. Oops. Yeah, party. <laughs> yep. Let's do that. I haven't, I haven't run with Igus in a while, so. Sounds good. Yeah, I wonder if we'll find another greedy shadow. If we don't, we may have to come back and grab that. That's uh, right. Yeah, probably. Well, I mean, I'll probably have to rerun through these areas anyway, so. so. We are looking at a guardian. 188. Yes. Or 193? Yeah, 193. 193. Mm -hmm. So, this guardian nulls slash right. electric and repels light. We should be all right weak, here. Weak to nothing. Weak to nothing. Necro machinery. It'll all be okay. Together we can't lose. That's cool. Mhm. Mm okay. The one foe lowers all their stats. Yeah, let's do that. Do it. Yep. <laughs> Concentrated too. Are you ready? Yep. Huh? A proper execution. Excellent. Uh huh. All right. What to do? Not mm. that. You could charge and then throw Scarlet Havoc. Yeah, oh, that's a good idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, there you are. Yeah. Okay. What is optimal? Uh, what is optimal? strike is what we're trying to avoid, right? No slash S slash. Yeah, sorry. I said okay. I had I said strike, but I had the right symbol in my head. Oh, I see. <laughs> yeah, I know that doesn't make any sense, but Palladium. yeah, except I understand what you mean. So now's the time. Come on, Persona. Boom. Those moments you're just like, why? Yeah. Oh boy, Mega Dolan. Do you think you can hit me? Nice reflexes, Yukari Chan. I was not ready for that. I'll show you. It's okay. It did terrible damage to you. All right. He's about do, to have a really bad day. Do it. Do it. Goodbye. You, you know what those no saw blades make me think of? What? Remnant 2. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> but yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> With the speed in which they move and just how like utterly dead you are when you touch them. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, ooh, no, do we... Lilith, nice. Yeah, Lilith is a very good persona, and we do have the level to make the Lilith, so. Insta heal. Um, yeah. Hmm. Ooh, now we can get through. You're on a roll, but what do you think, Mickey Coon? Want to keep going? Yeah, let's go. Okay. You got it. Think we'll make it to the next gatekeeper? Yes, yes, I do. Yeah. After I heal my party, good. To be clear, to be clear, the fact that it reminds us of Remnant Two is not a bad thing. It's the fact that those saws are 
ridiculous. They, yeah. <laughs> they, they're painful. Died to them 80 million times. Right. Ugh. We don't see that yeah, Lilith comes with Mabufudine and Maziodine, as well as Megadola, so... Pretty solid persona. Mm. That'll be a good one to make. Water God armor. Oh. Nicely done. I imagine it'd be more effective than what I'm currently using. Okay, so it can only go to Yukari or Mitsuru. Mm. Let's see what it does. Wata. He's using an emergency vest anti fire master. Reduce fire damage high. Interesting. I don't think that overwrites her weakness. She weak to fire? I think so, right? Uh, I believe so. I think, I think that's correct. Yes. Yeah, so that'd be good. I think she might still take a weakness hit from that, unless it nulls it out during battle. I, yeah, I doubt it'll null it, but even reducing the damage she'll receive from it, even though it's a weakness, will help. Tuxedo! Oh, oh good, a tuxedo. Thank you. Glad I spent three Twilight Fragments on aesthetics. Uh. Cosmetic DLC! Ah! <laughs> we all know the in-game's fashion. Uh, always is. Always has been. Mm. You missed. I did. On the one hand... How could you miss? On the it one was three feet in front. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. No, you're good. I was going to say, on the one hand, it's really nice to know that I'm overleveled, so to speak, for this area, because the enemies keep running away. Um, But on the other, like, I need the levels. Quit doing that. Run away, run away. Yeah. Power castle. Weak to ice. Well, okay. Resist fire and repels wind. Well, I'm glad it used Garadine on him then. Uh huh. Oh god. Goodbye. It's over. No shadows detected. Bye bye now. Bye bye now. Thank you. Bye bye. Goodbye. Thank now you. Bye bye. Let's get back to work. Lots of these chests in this one. Uh -huh. Generate three, nice. Uh, yeah. There we go. Dark. Darkness. I like the design on his sword. Yeah, it's really cool. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll always be a sucker for a good katana, but for something that's not katana shaped, it's good. seems effective here. Probably will freeze into this. Probably. Uh, nope, not this time. Curses! Look at this gun she's got on her wrist. It's a big gun. It is. I see her use it. Oh. <laughs> Boom! Kasha arts. I'm sorry, what? Yeah, Kasha arts is pretty strong. I am back in the fight. Um Akasha Arts is a multiple team members are strike move. Um it's the one I was saying might be stronger than Heat Wave. Um, all right. I have ten of these. Let's get Yukari up. I owe you one. Be effective. Make sure he doesn't die. Thanks. That is important. It is. <laughs> I have to do this. And then. Alright. 
now we're good. And then, oh, heat wave. Okay. Yeah. Shutting down. Come on. <laughs> It's so hard. It does. It really does. Rebooting. <clears throat> All right, let's finish this off. <laughs> Had enough of you. That about does it. It's over. No shadows detected. Brutal. Yeah. Gigantic fist. Bloody wood horse. Buzz rough. That was rough. Let's see. I wasn't expecting him to have Akasha Arts. Yeah. Um, so the one hit is slightly less powerful than Heat Wave. Um, higher crit chance. And you can do one to two hits, which is what kept killing party members there. The staircase. Mm. Is one of them would get hit twice. Yeah, that's fair. And just die. So, but in theory, Akasha Arts is probably a little better than Heat Wave, but Heat Wave is going to be more consistent. We yeah. Fair enough. It's your call. To me, even if you don't get any of the two hits, the trade off is worth it, mm. statistically speaking. So, I think I'd prefer Akasha Arts, but. That's also because with multi-target moves like that, I just kind of am like, you know, the good enough one. Whereas it's much more important to optimize single target moves because most bosses are a single target. Yeah, right, right. Makes sense. Except for with something like Hasotobi, because that hits all, but it doesn't matter. Right. <laughs> That's not in this game, though. Let's see. Oh, there's the Haven't we seen that door before? Why yes, Ikari. All of these lights? On like seventy other floors. Yeah. Maybe not seventy. But we've seen a lot of times. Yeah, this, is, <laughs> this is not a new occurrence anymore. I'm baffled by this new occurrence. Oh. My god. Eternal yes. sand. I'll do it. Weak to slash and strike. Repels ice, electric, nulls, light and dark. One target. This will be no problem at all. Now's the time. Uh, see. Yeah. And again. Meh. Oh. She's right. Annoying. You can use. Emery to shower on Yukari to clear that off. Yep. I can't. Um. Your status, that's why. You hit a weakness. Great work as always, Kirito Senpai. You hit a weakness. Activating. Persona. Damage inflicted. Direct hit on a Okay. Amazing. Pull the trigger. There we go. Woohoo! Haha, uh -huh. you can't stand up. This will do the trick. Ha 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 ha. You hit a weakness. Great work as always, Kirijo Senpai. What to do? Slash. Oh, one to four hits. You've struck a weakness. Allow me. Fit. It's over. Oh, that was cool. Nice, I guess. Yeah. Some fun. Persona. I appreciate it. Status ailment recovered. Mm. Wow. What's the plan here? Well, you suck. Like fish in a barrel. That was dumb. At least now you can all out. 
I mean, yeah, but... Look how much damage that did. He was Jeez. I know, he was practically done for already. Now he is again. Yep. Goodbye. That's a win for the team. <laughs> Good job, everyone. Tiara Han. Ugh. <laughs> uh, do I have him in my group? I don't think I do. Nope. Mm. Pretty sure you fused him before, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, definitely not a new one. I just didn't know if I can't remember if he was like part of my current list or not. We did it. Did the thing. Prime Nihil or Nihil. Nihil. All right. Now I can see everything. You can. Congratulations. Thanks. The enemy went away. Yeah, he did. <laughs> oh. Well, wind this is a big and ice. Big, big fight. Big, big Yoshi. Yep. It's a good thing she blocks. The reflection there. The second evolution personas are nice. Actually, no, plural would be persona, not personas. Oh, yeah? Yup. Hey, hey, Austin. Yeah? What if my persona was a bear? Would it be a bear Sona? Mm. <laughs> uh, an, would it be an Ursona? A what? An Ursona. An Ursona? Yeah. Sure. Like an Ursa, Ursa Major, Ursa Minor. Those are bears. Oh, sure. Yeah, yeah. No, no I wasn't following, but that's good. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, missing person. I'm getting the reading of a person. Please secure them. Problem? No. The visibility. Uh oh, this is a Reaper room. Reaper. I don't know if we can handle the Reaper right now. We got this. What do you mean? Resuming the operation. I'm actually not sure either. Uh, I'm pretty sure the Reaper is level 99, so the level gap might be a little brutal. Um, if there were a way to, like, save right now, I would say just try it, but... I can find a teleporter, maybe. A shadow. I don't remember. Do dark rooms stay? Yes, I believe so. Light and wind. And ice. Wow. All right. I have to do this. Outstanding. Sorry, I'm not one down. You're up next. All right. Sure. What to do? Yeah. Hold on. Enemy down. Do it. I'll take it from here. Yeah, you will. This will do the trick. <laughs> I'll show no mercy. <laughs> Rush him. Yeah. The pieces. Nice. Atropos. 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 I think we're about to the point where we can fuse Norn. We beat them to a pulp. Uh, level wise, yeah, probably. Yeah. I think Norn was 65. Pretty sure. I am Norn is weird. We should <laughs> we should fuse Norn if we can. I like Norn. It's dangerous. Stay ah. guard. Yeah. yeah, Norn is 65. All right. I'm happy to Here do that. If we can get to 68, we can fuse Alice. And with this, yeah. 
That'll be good. Yeah, after, um... I'm ready. After getting some grinding levels in, we could probably get it done. But yeah. Nothing will get there. At, well, no, we won't get there by the, we'll, by the time we get up to... We'll get there in five minutes. No! Yep. <laughs> five minutes for the viewer, maybe. Yeah. Well executed. Us, you now must edit. <laughs> for, for, for us, it's five hours later. That's true. If you're lucky. No, no again. Damage no again. That's so much. It's gonna be nice when you get Mediara huh? Oh, with her. yeah, for sure. Oof. I'll hit them where it hurts. Screw you, Benny. Oh. I'll go with. That's unacceptable, Mitsuru. There is at least one Megaton game where magic cannot miss. Garu die. Yeah. Throne. <laughs> All right, now he's got Kuga on. We have seized victory. Let us proceed. Excellent. Excuse me. <laughs> Object of value located. Yes, me. Right. Uh, the interesting of fights would occasionally come out of those. Hmm. Thinking of like trap chests, like I monster attacks you. Oh my god! Right. That'd be pretty neat. <laughs> That's pretty neat. What to do? Uh, yeah, I do have heat wave. Perfect. Excellent. There we go. All enemies defeated. It's over. Good work out there. Thanks. Now then, let. Excellent. More prime to heal blades. Where is our missing person? Just kind of hanging out in the dark. Right. There he is. So this would be the best way to like go back, and then have to run through the floor again if we wanted to do that to see if we could proc the reaper uh, oh oh I see sure you want to try it why not right what's the worst, right, what's the worst that's gonna happen yeah well we'll, <laughs> we'll just, just die and have to reload whatever yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right <sighs> all right Cool. Let's make sure we heal up. Um, I don't know that the party is going to matter a huge amount right now, um, but pick whoever you want. You can always pick the highest level people and bring them. Yeah. I would put it at Junpei, yeah, we... Yukari, and Ken or Mitsuru. I think we're okay with the current party. I think so too. It's up, it's up to you if you want to bring anybody else. Uh, I think this will work. This will be enough. Okay, make sure you save. <laughs> oh, we are almost level 68. Look at that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We're, we're pretty close. I didn't realize we were that close to level 70. I thought we were like in the 65 range still. But we fought several yeah. things that have had some really big experience points. That's true. We're doing well. Oh, Let's keep up the pace. it's gone. It's not dark anymore. It's not huh? dark anymore. All right, then. Should I undergo a large scale update sometime in the future? Okay, well, you know, next time. Yeah, recommendation is level 85, so we're definitely, we got a little ways to go still. Not too much. Not sensing any enemies, the next floor also seems safe. Uh, ought to be a border floor, let's investigate. Cool, so that means there's a monad passage floating around here somewhere. Yep. There it Almost. is. Perfect. Perfect. Since the layout of this floor doesn't change, this door likely won't disappear. Could explore at any time, but we're going to explore it right now. 
Right, Meow. We're going to explore it. Star Tarot is reacting. Um. Strong Shadows just beyond it. Please be careful. Uh, so viewers made it this far. Thank you so much. Uh, I've been wondering, what are your thoughts on the Arcana and the relationship that our party has with said Arcana? Let us know in the comments. Leave a comment. Talk about Arcana. Talk about shenanigans. Talk about anything, really. Yes. Yeah. All right. What we got here? It's another oh, snake. Spotted. Snakes Please, of the Bane. Hmm. Oh, goodness. A Amorous Snake. Okay, this is Devious. So Devious Maya resists everything. The Amorous Snake drains fire, repels light, is weak to ice. All right. And you said they resist everything, right? Correct. We'll do this then. This might actually help us for her. Yeah. Follow up with Magaru. Do we have Magaru dying yet on her? No, not yet. Shall I move to strike? Okay, Magarilla. Too late for you now. Ow. Your angel senpai knocked one enemy down. Alright, oh, status effect will want me switch. Do I have a Oh yeah. Oh, let's do this. that. That'll work. There we go. That's annoying. Uh, reflect magic, yeah, that makes sense. I'll go with Could always throw a big fizz attack. <laughs> yep. Let's do this one, I guess. Oh! <laughs> What to do? Do it again. That's a clean hit. Mufasa, Mufasa, Mufasa. All right. Oh, stupid reflect. Blah. Right. Ooh. The downed bow. What? That's not any good. All right. Well, that's the fun. That for Karn? Yo. That's fine. <laughs> One will get reflected, but she'll block it, so it's fine. Oh. I'm ready. Problems. I see what you did there. <laughs> That's it. Enemy down. The one foe. Freeze. You hit a weakness. Nope, Brave no freeze. Always, uh, come. And this is gonna hurt. Oh wait. <laughs> I forgot he blocks all that. <laughs> Andy. <laughs> yeah. My fear, G. I think I can use it now. What you got? What you got, Chica? Nice. It is time. Uh, Better nice. Let's do this. She needs some stronger fizz uh, piercing moves. Mm hmm. Ooh, She'll get him. Yeah. Nice reflexes, Yukari Chan. Microcarn. There's four of them. You can do this. Reflex magic. The time. Go ahead and heal. That is next one. Thank you, Mr. Blaze. Oh, yes. I guess learns Primal Force at level 64 mm. and a 
Akasha Arts at level 72. Shall I move to strike? Artemisia! Nice. Yeah, I believe for multi-hit on piercing, though, Myriad Arrows is about the best you're going to get. Well, I don't need necessarily multi-hit. She just needs some stronger piercing. Yeah, I guess I mean multi-target. Oh, yeah. That's a win for the team. It's over. Good job, everyone. Takes care of that. Good riddance. <laughs> All right. Ronda. Level up. Is that? The four of them gave up their lives to protect the snake like shadow. I wonder why they'd be willing to sacrifice themselves. Make you think a little. Um. There might be a treasure chest up ahead, but I can sense an enemy presence there too. We're gonna continue. We're not done yet. We can do this. It's only two more. Blue swimwear. Better good. Omega spear. Ooh. Sounds cool. It does. Memoir number four. The fog has lifted. I had no reason to waver in the first place. The world will be saved by the king of destruction. He who gathers the shadows shall be the one to rule. Let us call him the prince. Fascinating. The prince mentioned once again. Yeah. King of Destruction. Mm-hmm. Would you summon forth the glorious Mother of Destruction? Mm. Do you want the power? Do you want the... Do you want the power? <laughs> So this should be. I wonder if it's one battle with all these. Enemy spotted. Strong enemy, are you ready to fight it? I'm ready. Let's do this. Let's take it down. Three targets in our way. They're weak, but Three. Don't be careless. Okay. Eat balance. Like this opponent. Some of this is probably going to be obvious, but the heat balance uh, repels fire, ice, and it is weak to lightning and wind. And I believe the sky balance is another one here, weak to fire and ice, yep. and the opposite repels lightning and wind. I'll hit them where it hurts. Also a then the light balance, it looks like. The the last one is the light balance. It it repels light and dark and is not weak to anything. Shall I move to strike? Just concentrate on that one. Yeah. Alright. Mm, don't like that. <laughs> I'll hit them where it hurts. Oh my. I'm reading your vitals. You're doing great. <laughs> Rude. <laughs> Not weak to anything. Then let's do this. Yep. It's a good way to go. Remain. Target destroyed. Now's the time. Time to shine. Nice. All right. one down. You're up next. Sure. All right. Come. Give me critical. Nah. Nope. But that was still a good amount of damage. True. Not like this. No. <laughs> that was unfair. So was that. <laughs> That was a concentrated Ige on, right? Yeah. I owe you one. My footing. Three just 
Still weak, but she has strong resistance to fire from her armor. Yeah. I'll go with. Yeah. You want that? What to do? Get you out of here before you have a problem. Or more of a problem. Oh, perfect. It's all you. Yeah, that's good. You hurry, Chun. We have to do this. Your defense has fallen. Ice it. Just one left. It won't, it won't be everybody, but... Good enough. Alright. EXP. Money. Whole party gets healed. Yes, please. And that's how it's done. That's how it's done. There you have it. Shadow eliminated. Good work. Uh, a lot of shadows are really similar. How many variations does that one shadow even have? Oh, this is so confusing. Why don't we just pull off the plates and paint them all the same color? <laughs> Wait, that won't solve anything. Oh god, I'm losing my mind. It looks. I know that feel though. <laughs> right. It looks as though you've defeated all the shadows in this area. All we have to do now is open that treasure chest. Let's do it. Oh, whoa, there's only two of them this time? Very intriguing. This is your reward for victory. May I see what you find? Moon Tarot and Book mm. of I guess it was the... Normally there's three. Yeah. Seems the Moon Major oh. Arcana card can now appear during shuffle time. All current party mm. members will have their HP and SP fully restored. Heck yeah. By acquiring a Book of Cough... The number of major arcana cards attainable in day increased by one. Hmm. A card. Who would have put this here? Or is it simply coincidence? I do not know. Uh huh. It looks like it's dead end. Do you want to head back right away? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Okay, you be careful on your way. All right, cool. Let's go grab the last old document. A dead end. Looks like we can't progress so, any further for now. Um, I think we skipped a phase, by the way, on that balance fight. Oh, really? Because uh, it looks like they have the potential to summon the omnipotent balance. Oh. That sounds like that had been a problem. I'm kind of glad we missed it. <laughs> on the one hand. But on the other, like... Yeah, it's interesting. I've decided to leave the institution. I refuse to be involved in any crimes. The head researcher decided not to come with me. Maybe I'll open a store with my collection of antiques. That's an okay, so I'm pretty sure if you had killed Heat and Sky Balance first, Light Balance would have summoned Omnipotent Balance. I remember the days when I was happy Fascinating. to reach the 100th floor. Those were the days. I mean, same though. <laughs> when we reached 100, I was like, oh man. We're so far. So, yeah, exactly. Uh, we are going to have to come back and get a greedy shadow between floors 173 and 198 for a specific request. But we'll do that at some point. Yeah. I think it'll probably be the next time we go into Tartarus because I don't think it refreshes, but maybe it will. Oh, goodness. We are. Made it through. Yeah, we did. We're definitely at time, so. We will okay. um, either work on these requests and fusions post in between recording, or maybe uh, this is what we'll start on beginning of the next. Yeah, we can always start off with, with getting those done and get back into December um, here. Yep. Um, might as well. We, we got a couple requests to do, so yeah, I think we'll, we'll go through that next time, um, if that's cool with you. Yep, I will... Uh, probably try to get some more of a grind session in just to kind of keep pushing those levels because I know we need them. Yeah, levels are good. We're getting we're we're getting there. We're 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 making some good progress. We are. Um, maybe I'll put on the uh, what is it, the avaricious necklace or whatever. Is fifteen percent experience boost? Mm, that's a good idea. So we'll see if that helps. Um, I'd like to get. You know, depending on how much levels I can get from running this set. Um, theoretically, 
I'd like to get up to like 75, maybe 80, which I think is pretty doable for uh, Makoto here, but we'll see. Yeah, that would be nice. Yep. <laughs> anyway, if you like what you've been watching, uh, please hit the like button, subscribe, notification bell, all of that. It really helps us out and we want to be able to continue producing content. So if you can do that for us. That will help us create stuff for you. So to, help us with the algorithm, leave a comment, you know, yep. all the, all the stuff we want engagement from you. Yep. Got any thoughts? Definitely share. A yeah, absolutely. We, we love uh, comments. We're not always able to respond to every single one of them. Um, but we, we do our best to, to go through and read them all and, uh, react to the ones that we can and, and stuff. So, uh, definitely leave comments, whether it's related to the game or not. Like I said before, it could be about anything really. Um, if you don't want to wait for the next episode for persona three, which of course, you know, the next one will be Thursday, but you're like, ah, it's too far away. Yeah, check out other stuff. We've got plenty of other playlists that are completed that you can binge watch. Even if you just like the sound of my sultry voice in the background, um, <laughs> <laughs> helps you sleep. I don't know. Hey, if, hey, if we help you sleep, I'll take that as a win because that means we're a safe that's space, right? right? Um, and that's what we want to be, right? So, all I'll just say, check it out. I'm sure you'll find something you'll enjoy that you'll get a laugh out of. Uh, but more than anything else, we just want to thank you so much for letting us be a part of your day. And we do hope that it is a wonderful one one that you've been able to decompress from a busy day maybe or maybe you're getting ready to start it however it looks but we do hope it's a great day and we will see you all in the next video we'll see you next time everyone bye bye now diddly diddly do 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 thanks for watching